Hey tribe, my name is Kirsty Pratt. If you are new to my channel, I am a holistic health practitioner, a five-time American Ninja Warrior, and a Sui Reiki master. My channel is all about giving you tools for holistic health, inner work, limiting beliefs, and self-growth. Today I'm making a video to talk about the 28 day elimination diet that I am currently doing right now. I am showing my progress all through my Instagram story. For some reason, it's having trouble linking to my Facebook. I'm gonna blame that on Mercury retrograde going on right now. But what I wanted to do is I wanted to talk about why I'm doing it, why I'm documenting it, and the other things that I'm doing along with it. Because through my coaching, I do believe that nutrition is a very, very important thing to teach people and coach people. And I do believe that there's a lot of misinformation out there around nutrition. So during this 28 day elimination diet, which I am excluding, I am getting rid of processed sugars. I'm also going to be eliminating my nightshades as well as some fruits that are super high in sugar. I am staying away from dairy. I am staying away from gluten. All of my foods that I will be getting, I may not be necessarily saying them in my Instagram posts or always saying it in my Facebook posts. And I'm going to make a recap video if you guys are just watching through YouTube. I may not always say it in my posts, but everything I get, I make sure that I'm getting it 100% organic or certified organic or my meats are going to be 100% grass fed, my fish are going to be wild caught, my chicken are going to be free range, and some of those principles are things that I you know, dive in deeper to with my coaching. I'm actually, you can kind of see some things over here. I'm going to be doing another video if you want to tune into that, breaking down some of the principles that I'm going to be talking about today. So as I'm eliminating those, I'm not gonna be having any processed foods. I'm not doing this to lose weight. I'm not doing it to necessarily tone up. What I am doing it for is I'm doing to see how foods are reacting to my body. This is going to be my second time doing it. I'm wanting to bring awareness of where I'm getting emotional eating cravings. Um, I'm just coming off of a week of kind of emotionally eating knowing that I'm emotionally eating, but also I was eating a lot of more processed foods than what was feeling good for my body. And last time I did the 28 day elimination diet is it felt incredible. And so I want to be documenting it to show you guys kind of what I'm going through, way, the way I'm going about it. with this are the principles that I think are highly, highly important. I'm making sure that I'm getting sleep every night. With my sleep, I'm making sure that I'm going with the circadian rhythm. I find it a whole lot better when I'm getting to bed by 10 p.m. and up by 6 a.m. I am also making sure that I'm taking time to meditate throughout my day. Um, it may not be long meditations, it may only be about five minutes, but I'm making sure that I'm getting some sort of quiet time for myself. I'm making sure that I'm getting enough water in um, as I'm gonna be going through this, I have been struggling with my water as well and making sure that I'm drinking at least half my body weight in ounces a day is going to be a big thing for me. Movement, um, I will be doing different types of movements. I'm going to also be documenting it and showing it on my Instagram. Once the week is up, what was my food that I ate fully? What was my um, exercises that I did? Kind of where I meditated, everything that I did on the meditation because with movement, that's gonna go in spurts, especially for me being a woman. I definitely track my movements with my cycle. So I'm gonna at least be aiming for 20 minutes, but you guys may notice in the beginning, it might actually be like an hour and 30 minutes. And then as it kind of goes on and goes closer to my menstrual menstruation cycle, um, I kind of ease back a little bit. And that's another thing that I get more in depth in my coaching with women of how we're different than men in that part. And, and the reason why, you know, I'm, I'm doing this and including all this is really, I really wanted a fresh start with everything that I was doing. I could see that my mindset was not getting, um, was not in the place that I wanted it to be. And so I'm also going to be including affirmations in this part. I'm also going to be including affirmations in this part as well, as well with those foundational principles. And those are all in different things that I coach. I do believe that nutrition is a very high 
um, high part to look into when you are on your own healing journey. And I also do believe that it does take a, um, a variety of categories to help you through this. And I just wanted to document it and share with you what I'm going through with what I'm feeling and show you the results telling you everything along the journey. And if you guys have any questions or any curiosity about the 28 day elimination diet, please reach out. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe on to this video in particular. You can also catch more free content on my podcast, which is the Kirsty Pratt podcast, K-I-R-S-T-I. Kirsty Pratt podcast. I also get other experts on there talking about diving deep into all sorts of topics, whether it be on food, relationships, mindset, all sorts of things. And you can also catch me on Instagram and Facebook where I will be documenting this at holistic.coach.kirsty. Thank you so much, Tribe, for coming in and tuning in today. I hope you guys have a fantastic day and uh, I'll catch you next time. All right, thanks.